Marius Briadis is slated to defend his uh, title against a heck of the opponent, Jaya Petaya. Marius Briadis, 29 wins, sorry, 28 wins, 1 loss, 20 wins by the way of a KO. He is uh, the former Latvian national champion and uh, WAKO European champion. This guy, this guy destroyed majority of the people, fought to a decision against Alexander Usyk, majority decision loss. And this guy is IBF and the ring cruiserweight title champ. Recently, he destroyed Arthur Mann, Yunel Dortikos, Krzysztof Klovacki, Noel Javor, Brandon Deslorier, Marku Huck, Mike Perez, Simon Valley, and many, many other uh, high level opponents. And now it's his time to shine against Jaya Petaya. Jaya Petaya is another the heck of the opponent. 6 foot 175 inches of reach for Briedis. For Jaya Petaya, this guy is IBF Hejo Shvenia and WBO Global Cruiserweight Champ. His reach is uh, 76. He is 6 foot 2. 21 wins, 17 by the way of a KO. This guy at World Youth Championships won bronze medal in Yerevan in men's amateur boxing, then transitioned to professional career. And uh, he holds notable stoppages over Daniel Russell, Benjamin Kelleher, Mark Flanagan, Nicholas Karolampios, Navisa Yata, Curtis Pegoraro, Lukas Pajowski, and many, many other high level opponents. There is only one problem here. Bredis, Bredis got used to fighting. For 12 rounds, for 10 rounds, this is kind of normal for him. And Jaya Petaya only fought, I think, once against Nicholas Karolampius when he won WBA Oceania Interim Cruiserweight title and WBO Global Cruiserweight title via anonymous decision. Bredis is uh, more tactical, but Jaya Petaya is fast, man. This guy is so, so fast. So it's gonna be so hard for me to predict who's gonna win. Bredis, as much as I know, he has never been knocked out. Opetaya, never been knocked out too. I'm gonna go with over 8.5. Very hard for me to predict the side. If I must pick a side, I'm staying away. Both fighters are extremely high level fighters. No, not picking a side here. Over 8.5 gonna be my pick.